legislation consists of many of the core elements that I discussed earlier, and I think people should really look to it as a sort of progressive conscience of the debate. It has over 90 co-sponsors. Um, it has a lot of progressive support. But ultimately, you know, the debate is going to start in the Senate, and, and Schumer is going to be the one who drafts that bill with the help of Lindsey Graham. And from there, it will move to the House Judiciary Committee, where Zoe Lofgren will be the one who, who writes the House bill. With that said, I mean, I think we should keep looking to the debate, to the bill that Gutierrez authored as, as a, a progressive groundwork. And I think by, by writing that bill, first of all, he was able to, to guarantee a spot on the negotiating table for himself and the rest of the Hispanic caucus and progressives who support um, the items in his bill. He was also able to really push lawmakers into facing this issue. You know, he presented this bill and now he needs them to respond to it. And I think on top of that, we should also remember that the bill, though progressive, isn't perfect. So there's something very important that's missing from that bill, um, which I think progressives should be concerned about. And that's the lack of a provision that would give um, same-sex binational couples the ability to um, sponsor their partners in the same way that you know heterosexual couples are able to. And that's not in his bill. We don't know what's going to be in Schumer's bill, but I think everyone should remember that there's going to be plenty of opportunities to get that included throughout the legislative process. And in the end, any sort of comprehensive immigration reform is going to benefit the LGBT community. So, you know, I think we should look to that bill um, and we should hold it up as, as you know, part of our ideals. Um, you know, Gutierrez said that he wanted his bill to be the public option for progressives and, and we shouldn't compromise on, on several items that are present in his legislation.